all of these birds. Hey guys, what's up? Guess where I am? Well, first I guess you should say, welcome back to the channel. Sorry it's been a little while since I uploaded. Uh, life's been crazy. But, it's been a while since I've been to the pheasant farm, which is where I'm at. And we're gonna go check out some birds. Then hopefully there'll be enough sunlight left that we can go home and check out some of the pigeons and stuff at my house. So, uh, let's get moving. Now, one thing, like I really hadn't thought a whole lot about coming out to the pheasant farm until I could like help catch them or something. Uh, but a buddy of mine invited me to go pheasant hunting uh, on opener. And I haven't done that in a long time because I've been duck and goose hunting for a while. And it sounded like fun. So I thought, shoot, if I come out here, I'm gonna ask you guys, do you guys wanna see me go on a pheasant hunt or should I get into ducks and geese right away? I don't know. You guys, you guys need to let me know down in the comments what you think. Cause they both, they both sound like fun. One sounds like a whole lot more walking. The guy said there's gonna be like 20 guys, like 12 miles of walking. Sounds exhausting. Um, but yeah, let me know what you guys think. Ooh yeah, look at how pretty they are. That's such a gorgeous bird. And they are everywhere. We'll take a look at them here shortly. They're all down there. We'll see how many of them want to talk to me. Don't see a ton of hens out, but uh, I know there's a few. Whoa! I didn't mean it the way it sounded. Oh. Listening to them bust out like that. If you guys are pheasant hunters, that's got to make you want to go. Yep. Anyway, obviously, uh, they're definitely wild enough. They're not used to people really being around them that much. Ah. <laughs> it's so cool. It's been a while since I've been out here, so it's just, yeah, birds, awesome. But as you can tell, all of the, the shrubbery has died off. A little bit easier to see into it now, but they're definitely sitting on top of it, breaking a bunch of it down. I don't want to push them too hard. I don't want to scare them too much, get them all worked up. That'd be a bad deal. Yep, yep. That's just awesome. Hey, you dude. Wanna hang out? I'll take that as a no. Let's go down to the next pen because I don't want to work these guys up too much. They seem a little bit on the skittish side. So uh, let's go to the other pen and see what they're doing there. What's it like on the inside, man? All right, I'm in here in one of the oldest pens. These guys are number one roosters by far. I mean, I don't know if you can see them real well, but look how long their tails are. Beautiful birds. Here in a second, I'm sure that we'll be able to get a good, good look at a couple. So uh, there's not that many birds left in this one. Whoa. Oh, they're going crazy. I don't want to freak them out like that. One reason this pen's so skittish is uh, a guy just came and picked up 115 of them, like literally a half hour before I got here. So yeah, they're a little worked up. So I'm gonna back out of here before they get too much crazier, but uh, we're gonna go over into the other pen and see if we can find that uh, white leucistic looking bird. You know, the one that has a whole bunch of white and weird colors on it. So hopefully we'll get some good footage of him. He's over there. All of these birds. Oh, there he goes. Look at that cool one. Look at that cool one. Anyway, we'll not stress these birds out too much more, but I want to show you old, old grandpa bird there. Wish he'd walk out in the open a little bit more, but you know, you guys get the idea. Uh oh, we got an escapee. Unfortunately, I'm not catching him. There is no way that I am fast enough or anything like that to catch that guy. But uh, there are some baby goats here, so we're gonna check out the baby goats before we go bombing home. Hopefully, there'll be enough light for all this. Hey, baby goats. 
Oh, don't be all worried. Yeah, they're kind of cool. Well, hi, Mama. How are you? Hey, baby goat. Hey, pretty goat. Hey, babies. Hey, babies. You're kind of cool. Boop. Hey, those are my pants. Don't eat them. Cool looking babies. Yeah. Hmm? Anyway, yeah. Let's get home, look at some pigeon stuff. I just thought you guys might like to see the baby goats. Because baby goats are fun. Hope we have baby goats again soon. Man, I am losing daylight fast. Sun's already down. Luckily, I'm almost home. But yeah, kind of fun to go back out to the pheasant farm again. I haven't been there in a minute. Long minute. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, for the guys that are going to ask what he does with the birds. Actually, this is really, really jiggly. Hold on just a second. So anyway, uh, for all you guys out there that are going to be asking uh, if he has any birds left for sale. Um, no. Actually, I think he has about 200. But I think he already has a lead on where those are going. So, uh, sorry, no birds there. Uh, he doesn't ship either. Boy, it's getting dark. Getting dark so fast. Uh, let's quickly get out of here and... Uh, Look at some stuff around the farm real quick. But I did want to say, as much as I was so excited to see those birds blow up, and if you guys hunt pheasants at all, that, that should have done something for you. Uh, but just watching them blow up and stuff, I heard a flock of geese go over, and it stopped everything I was doing, and I had to find out where these birds were. So, yeah, I, I really need to know what you guys want to see. Some more waterfowl? Should I go do pheasant? You guys got to let me know. Anyway, let's go. It's light enough. Look at the turkeys. Look at the racing homers, which there's some good news, bad news there. And at the goats. So let's go do that. You are too fat to be on there. Here, can, can, there you go. Hey, everybody. Yeah. So this is the turkeys last week here. Yeah. Well, not for all of them, just for a lot of them. Uh, Thanksgiving's coming and their time is running out, but there's a bunch of them. They're a little bit too small to actually get butchered So they'll get to hang out for a little while longer Here are the racers so as you can tell there's five uh, The proven pair Okay, well long story short This came undone somehow and the door opened up and I'm sure that that pair flew back to their original home. And I went through my Instagram and I can't find the guy's name anymore. I'm really bummed actually. I can't, can't remember what it was. So otherwise I would have got a hold of him and said, hey, by the way, the birds are still... Calm down. Otherwise I would have let him know, hey, the birds are on their way back. Sorry, I hope they hang out. But uh, the good news is, is these guys, when they got out, came back. Which, obviously I still haven't got a trap put in, but after that... Oh, you're loud! Why? <laughs> they make it so hard to talk sometimes. Uh, anyway. Um, anyway, it really, really got me excited to get this thing finished up, get a trap made, uh, and actually start flying it because that needs to happen. So. Yeah, I know I promised it a million times, but like I'm, I'm pretty pumped about it right now. Okay guys, I have feed, but last time I tried to film you guys in feed, you almost broke my camera. No breaking the camera. Hey Jeep! Uh, hey look! <laughs> Chunky boy. He's still getting bullied though. The girls are not treating him as nice. Hey! No! Bad. You're a jerk. The girls are not treating him quite like they should, but hopefully they'll warm up. Hey Ryan! Hey, dude. How you doing, brother? Yeah? I understand. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's feed him, bud. To make sure he doesn't get bullied too much, I feed him back here behind the barn so they can't see. Uh-uh. No. You don't know. You don't know. Ugh, almost tripped. Anyway. The goats are doing good, but look at the size of Karen here. I, do you think, do you think? Is she just fat? Is she preggers? I mean, the other goats aren't fat fat. Well, she's kind of chubby. 
But that, I mean, good grief, Karen. Either you're pregnant or you've let yourself go. One way, I'm gonna be super happy. The other way, I'm just gonna be impressed. But, you know, whatever. If she is bred, that means old Tank did something, uh, you know, did a thing, which he wouldn't be related, which is good. Uh, but yeah, that'd be interesting, right? I don't know, let me know what you guys think. Does she look pregnant or she just look fat? But the goats still packing on the pounds for winter. Still got a bale of hay for them. You know, been feeding them obviously. You need to grab my bucket and we'll go check the water real quick. But anyway, uh, sorry it's so dark. It gets dark here at like, I mean, it's what, five o'clock now, quarter after, and it's too dark to go film in the big lofts because it's so, there's not enough light in there. I mean, that's what dark means, I guess. But uh, the rut is really starting to happen around here, and the shop, we do a lot of deer, which means I'm working late. A lot of stuff going on, haven't got to film as much as I want to. So, I'm gonna try and pack a lot of time in on the weekends. Uh, you guys gotta let me know. This Saturday, am I going pheasant hunting? Am I going duck hunting? Am I going goose hunting? I'm gonna do my best to pick, you know, whatever you guys are going with, but I need to know soon. Uh, I'm also planning on shooting a deer, maybe two. Um, I've been talking to Gerald and Bobby over at Sandhill Flyways, and actually that's their Instagram there. You should, you know, go check them out. Uh, and they told me, hey, there's like five does, six does about behind the lodge. Go shoot one. Well, that's that's actually a pretty good idea. So uh, I've been thinking about doing that. Anyway, yeah, trapping season's coming. I'm pumped. I'd like to get some cool stuff tanned again. I haven't got my first back yet for the ones that I sent off. Uh, they should be back any time. I'm surprised they're not back yet, but I'll let you guys know as soon as they get here. Anyway, uh, I gotta dump the water, put some new water in. Appreciate you guys watching this video. I know it wasn't much. It's just a little update what's going on. Uh, yeah, I, I wish I had something super exciting, but I hope you guys liked it. Little update on how everything's doing. Uh, but if you guys did like the video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button for me. I'd really appreciate it. Uh, if you want to see more stuff coming on from the channel, a little bit more hunting and stuff like that, please don't judge my channel by this video alone. Please. Uh, but you can subscribe. You can also unsubscribe later. I mean, that's fine. But, you know, you could subscribe and see what comes out next. But beyond that, um, we'll just see you next time.